Hey you guys, so we've just finished up installing Super Repo. So what have we done to this point? We've installed Kodi 15.1 in our first video. We followed up in our second video. We installed Fusion and ran the config wizard. And now we're to the point that we're going to set up some live TV. Okay, so to do that we're going to use the IPTV PVR Simple Client. Now let's go ahead and just get started. So first thing I want to do is I want to go to inquisitivetv.com and I want to grab a link that's over there, okay? So to do that, let's go to this first link right here and let's just copy it. Okay, so let's go back into Cody and let's go ahead and get started. Let's go into System and let's click on TV and up here at the top on the general we want to scroll out and we want to click on enabled okay so we want to enable it so let's click OK and now let's go and find the PVR IPTV simple client okay so we're going to right click on that and let's configure it and under general right here m3u playlist url the link that we just copied we're going to click on that and the link that we just copied we're going to paste it in okay and with that we can hit done and now we're at epg settings okay so i'm going to hit the windows button on the keyboard and go back to the website and right here the second link is the epg so let's go ahead and copy that one and we'll paste that one in so we want to go right here to the URL okay so I'm going to hit control V and we'll paste that in there and we'll say done now the channel logos okay so once again let's go back to the website and right here on the bottom IPTV logos We'll go ahead and copy that. And get back here to the logos. And uh, right here on the where it says the URL, we'll paste that in there. Again, Control V. Done. And with all of that, we're going to say OK. Now, let's go ahead and click on that this time and enable it now let's go back hit the home button again we'll go back into system we'll go back into TV and where we enabled it a minute ago let's click on that again to disable it for just a moment and then we'll click on it again to enable it and you can see we have stuff loading up there at the top and hopefully this puts this in our menu bar okay so if it doesn't we may have to restart Cody but it did it put it in there so let's go ahead and see if the guide is working now I know the times are off but it is working so let's go ahead and just go in and try one link and test it out real quick and generally I just check out CNN and that's the only reason I ever come in here and like I said I don't use this a lot guys but like I said some links work and some links don't but I always have this installed so we'll click on CNN just to try it out here okay so it looks like maybe this is just one of those links that's not going to work that's okay guys I don't want to stretch this video out like I say some of the links do work and some of them don't you can kind of go through there and get the idea once you get this set up anyway we're going to go ahead and wrap it up we've got our live TV installed through our IPTV PVR client we'll see you guys in the next video